Good day, my name is Peter. Welcome to the VAT Short and Sweet series where we explore the world of value-added taxes. The series consists of several short presentations that build upon each other. Today we're at presentation number three of 15 in our journey. See the presentation topics covered in this series for a full list of the presentations. The verbal script is not a verbatim of the written text. You can pause the video at any time to read the full text. The goal of this presentation is to provide a brief description of key VAT terms. This presentation does not seek to provide a detailed or official legal glossary of terms. Here are some of the common terms we find associated with VAT. First one obviously is value added tax or VAT, a system that seeks to tax the value added at each stage of the distribution process. We discussed this in a previous presentation where we showed how the, the VAT process works. Next term is agent, a person duly representing another person. Example, a person acting on behalf of a VAT authority Alternative reporting method, a method of reporting that does not necessarily follow the conventional VAT concept of VAT collected minus VAT paid. Again, we covered this in an earlier presentation. Business activity, an activity with a reasonable expectation of profit over a certain period. Change of use, a change of use occurs when a good or service used for one purpose is then used for another purpose. Example, a car used in a business that is then used exclusively for the personal use of the owner. Consideration, the amount given in exchange for something else, example, cash in exchange for goods. Credit note, a document that indicates an amount that is due to its holder, deemed. An event that has occurred even though it may not be obvious, example, a barter of goods may be considered a deemed sale, exempt, an item that is not subject to VAT. A person making an exempt supply is often not entitled to a refund of the VAT paid on their related purchases. Fair market value, an amount that would be given in exchange if both parties to a deal were independent of each other. Example, to strangers. Input tax credit or refund, a credit for VAT paid on purchase. Inquiry, a request for information the request often attempts to establish compliance with a relevant VAT law. Intangible property, an item that cannot be touched, example, a copyright, a license, a patent or trademark. Jurisdiction, a subject matter or territory that falls under the responsibility of a particular VAT authority. Mixed supply, a transaction that is a combination of items that have a different VAT status, example, a taxable at the regular rate and zero rated, or taxable at the regular rate and exempt. Multi-tier distribution, a distribution system that uses many intermediaries between the person initiating the transaction and the final consumer. The product distributed often stays the same as it works its way through the distribution system, i.e. it's often not transformed. Person, a distinct entity, example, a company, a partnership, or a sole proprietor. Prescribed content or form, a document containing information or any format required by a VAT law. Real property, an item related to real estate, example, land or building. Registration, a process of enrolling with a relevant VAT authority. Self-assessment, a process of collecting, reporting, and remitting VAT from oneself. Supply, a transfer of goods and, or service. Example, sale, lease, rental, barter, or change of use. Tangible personal property, an item that can be touched. Example, car, furniture, or inventory. Taxable, an item subject to VAT at the regular rate or zero rated. Threshold, a point upon which something happens. Example, registration for VAT. Value added tax, 
VAT, we've already covered this at the beginning of this presentation. VAT authority, a government agency that has a responsibility to administer a particular VAT law. Zero rated, an item taxable at 0%. A person making a zero rated supply may be entitled to a refund of the VAT paid on their related purchases. Thank you for watching and we'll see you in the next presentation.